Oh. Welcome guys. Uh, so in this video, uh, let me talk about the harmonic number. Okay. So the idea for this video is uh, we want to prove that the harmonic number is basically the state of long n. So if you are familiar with computer science, that people like to say that uh, this hn is in a uh, state of long n, basically hn is uh, constant, can be bounded by constant growth of the uh, long n, uh, basically natural log n. <coughs> okay, and uh, not only that, uh, so usually uh, in this video I will provide two ways to prove it. Okay, so the first way, uh, the, the zero, uh, I should say the three ways. Okay, so the first way is that uh, if you know about number theory or many uh, like advanced calculus, uh, you can go to my video channel and uh, and uh, check and type this h n minus long and you will say you you can see there's a constant called called the Euler Majorani uh, Majorani constant. Basically, it's defined to be h n minus long n as n goes to infinity. Okay. Okay, so this h n is defined to be one plus a half plus one over three, one over four, one over five, up to one over n. Okay, so uh, in this, so the first way is very easy. We just first see a lower bound. Okay, so the lower bound is easy to just change this one over three to one over four, one over four, and the one over five, six, seven, eight into eight. Okay, so you get this, you get this. So you see, uh, the answer will be the log two, uh, base n divided by half. Okay. Uh, let's say if n equals to four, uh, you get uh, what? You get the uh, n equals to four. You get uh, let's say you get one, right? So you get one. One plus one is two. So which is this guy? Okay. So the answer will be half the uh, plus the log two, and this is a a uh, ceiling. Okay. And the h n for the upper bound, you just take this one over three to be half. And the four, five, six, seven to be four, 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 and to do the same thing. And the easy argument is that this will be cell, uh, uh, floor function of log to n. So from these two, right? From these two, you see that h n is one plus log n, log to n, and then you can change log to n into a basis of natural log and the original long n. So now you see h n is, uh, upper bound, uh, lower bound is bounded by constant growth of log to n, and the uh, lower bound of uh, the h n is lower than this uh, constant growth of log 2n. So combine these two, you get h n is state uh, long n. So this is the first proof. Okay, and the second proof is also <coughs> uh, common if you like the calculus. Okay, so this is uh, so this video like the very short introduction to the harmonic number. Okay, so h n is this. Okay, so from picture that you see that this is one, right? Two, three. So if you see the you you can see the lower bound uh, the upper bound that H N will smaller than one plus the area below one to n okay so get this one plus one to n one over t d t so it's one plus long n okay and the H N is greater or equal to area before one to n plus one okay so it's this one so it's long n plus one and you can write as long n plus long one plus n so it's one long n plus one over n plus this uh theta uh, sorry this is uh theta or big O one over n square or if you see this so it's like a long n plus one over n plus uh, o one over n square less than h n and one plus long n so if you see if n is greater n is n increases then uh, obviously the h n will be theta long n okay so these are the these are the common approach about this asymptotics uh, of harmonic number. Okay, the next uh, maybe we will see other harmonic num uh, we will see other asymptotics in the future. Okay, I will see you guys in the next video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. Thanks.